hey guys welcome back to my channel so I have a teeny teeny tiny Dollar Tree haul I didn't find much this week but I do have an honorable mention of a product that I just used last night first let me show you what I picked up this uh, this today <laughs> I was gonna say this week but I forgot I had already did a haul this week um, I finally found the cute little washi tape with the cactus on it and the watermelon and pineapples and I was looking for these and they are just super cute now did I need these no I didn't and you guys will soon find out why I did not need these <laughs> okay so then I also grabbed another magnetic list uh, list pad the last ones that I have been finding did not have the magnet on the back and I really like the ones with the magnet because I can put it on the refrigerator so I just got this one because I like the mason jar. Uh, now this next thing, I forgot, let me put those out there. This next thing was this teacher's lesson planner. Now this is basically for teachers and it has the student information, parent, teacher, guardian. Or, I mean, it says name, parent, guardian, and contact. Now for me, the reason why I picked this up is because, look, it has the seating chart, which I don't need, the substitutes page. These are really, really nice for teachers. Um, but the reason why I picked it up is because stud uh, it has the student birthdays, but it says subject and then it does the day of, of the week and notes down here. And I thought this would be perfect for me to keep track of my kids' homework. Like with my daughter, sometimes she may have a project that may be due. Um, she might get it on Monday and it might be due Thursday or Friday. And just so that I can stay on top of whatever she's doing as well as since Pooh Bear will be going into kindergarten I know he'll have his little assignments or his little homework or whatever so just for me to keep track of my kids homework and everything because I get really busy through the week and I just want to make sure I write it down and that way I can remember what they need to do so that's why I picked up one of those I did see this and it's new I have never seen one of these before and I thought this was super cute it says it's like a it kind of changes there it is see that it's a little boy and it says operation groom and go and it's a body wash shampoo and conditioner and it smells really good and it's berry blast I would be using this as a body wash um, I wouldn't use it as shampoo not for Pooh Bear but I thought that was super cute and it looks like a little walkie talkie and everything that is just super cute um, I did grab one of these they had some really cute eyeglass cores and I've seen them before but I just never picked them up but I did like these this one with the little beads or whatever so I got those to use for my glasses for when I'm sitting there reading or watching TV I saw these which I had never seen before cheese stuffed breadsticks real mozzarella with parmesan cheese garlic and sea salt I cannot wait to try these um, to see if they're going to be any good it says cook directly from freezer cooking time you can put them in the oven the microwave if you put it in the microwave you just open one end of this for venting and then put it in there for a minute to a minute and a half uh oh or you can put them in the oven so I got those uh, I did get a couple of these I'm not I didn't bring them all in here to show but I did pick up some lemons for some decor uh, so I did get those now before I show you the honorable mention have you ever just found something at Dollar Tree and you was just super excited by it? it might not even be like this major thing but it's something that made you super happy well this next item I'm super excited by I love I think in the past I found one other book that was by this author and I literally have about 10 to 12 books of his because I this is by far my favorite author Eric Jerome Dickey I love 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 his books when I start one I cannot finish it like I mean I, I can't I, I can't go long without reading it like I'll get stuck in this and I'll finish this in like probably two or three days just because I love his books um so it retailed for 16 it looked yeah 16 and it was dropped to 12 and now it was a dollar in Dollar Tree so this is by far my favorite find I would say um, probably recently uh, even in my other hauls I love that I found another Eric Jerome Dickey book and then I also picked up this one creating a successful business from scratch um, I got this for one of my sisters and so 
yeah okay so did you guys hear that in the background my neighbor is having a party and he just did a, a air horn or something like that okay so I meant to bring a, um, bring the other two in here with me. It was some other oven cleaners that I had actually picked up from the 99 cent only store. And I tried two different brands from 99 cent only store. And I used them and they didn't work that great. Um, it, the, it wasn't like a horrible mess. But uh, one of the kids has spilled something in the oven. And it was kind of stuck. Like the grease was kind of stuck. So it was hard to get up. So the other two things that I tried did not work at all. I went and I was when I was walking through um, Dollar Tree because I hauled this stuff la uh, yesterday. So uh, last night when I came home, I used this, and you guys, I am surprised. Not saying that because it's at the Dollar Tree that is that I'm surprised it worked, but this works so good. If you are looking for a oven cleaner. Uh, to clean inside the oven or even on top of your burners or you know you know the top of the stove try this this works so so good so that's my honorable mention a must try from Dollar Tree so um, that's really it for my haul okay wait a minute you guys wait do I have pictures <laughs> you guys last night I was sitting up and I was trying to think of a DIY project right and I have this inspiration photo, which I should insert right now. And I like those centerpiece type of, you know, candle holders or whatever. And so I was sitting there and I was thinking, what do I have around that I could try to recreate that, right? <laughs> this, these are the items um, that I actually use to try to recreate this so as you can see there was a a rolling pin one of the rolling pins all of those items you could find at Dollar Tree but the rolling pin I was like what can I do with this rolling pin and I have something else in mind for the rolling pin but I wanted to see if I could incorporate it into this DIY right and so you guys look at what I made <laughs> okay so I mean I give it an A for effort because I was really trying to be super creative or whatever you know I, I don't think I am the best DIYer um, by by far you know what I mean but I just I thought I just say I get an A for effort <laughs> it came out okay uh, I think it's all right, but it's not like the best. And I didn't know that I was even going to make that, so I didn't create a video or anything for it. But I did want to share that with you guys. So, uh, yeah, I just thought that was something funny. So, anyways, you guys, thank you for watching. Stay tuned. I'm sure I'll have some more videos coming up soon through the week. I hope you guys are all having a beautiful day, and I will talk to you later. Oh, stay tuned because I have some pictures coming up. Okay, bye, you guys.